So one thing great about uh, serving God is you get to know people, you get to know the power of God in their lives. You have all these testimonies that are coming. So today I want to encourage you, get out, get out of your seat, get out of your couch and wherever you go, you don't need to go like me to the Middle East, all over the world, but the world is here. When you go to a restaurant, when somebody's serving you, when you're in an Uber, you're in a cab, wherever you are, the world is here and people need you. God wants to work with you. And when you start opening your mouth, that beautiful mouth, instead of complaining, but sharing and telling people about the good news, you're going to see how many amazing stuff God is going to bring to your way. No dull moment, not a dull moment in your life when you live your life for Jesus Christ. So one of my uh, you know, live broadcasts to the Middle East, this Muslim man called, and they tell it to my ear. They said, this man is calling. He says that he has Satan in him. And I hear it all recorded. This man called and he said, uh, Ushuk Abla, I have Satan in me. And I don't know what to do. So when somebody says, I have Satan in me, it's a big thing because I don't think, you know, Satan is, is the big guy and he will go after the big guys too. You know, but I understand that this guy was demon possessed. And we could hear on air other noises were coming from the background as well. And the one thing I do on air, what are you going to do? Somebody is saying, I have a demon. You pray. You just cast it out. And one day God spoke to me and he said, when I asked him, can I do it on TV? Can I do it live on air? He said, he's the power of the prince of the power of air. He's called that. Yes, you can definitely cast it out through the airways. You can definitely cast him out through the phone, Skype, whatever. You can come against the enemy through the airways. So when I knew about this, I started just declaring and casting it out. And very quick. It's not like rah, 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 forever. And it was a very quick event. And this guy was willing. The most important part about deliverance, if the person is really willing. Sometimes people say, you know, I have Satan, I have demons, blah, blah, blah. Just to impress you, you say, wow, what, what he said. No, don't be impressed. Don't be impressed with the enemy. Okay, you have that? Let's cast it out. Do, are you ready for your deliverance? Because some people are not ready and then you cannot do it. One thing to do it definitely is for you to take charge. Use your authority in Christ and just speak. And don't wear yourself out for hours. When the pe person is ready, you can do it in few seconds in Jesus' name.